What's up guys, back in today with another reaction to Psyche K, this time with episodes 86 through 90 or episode 18 I think. Uh, looking forward to seeing what we've got today, yeah, last episode was uh, another really good one. Uh, a lot of focus on Kobe Asu last episode which was really nice, uh, kind of out with himself with the uh, bit of delinquent he is, but um, he is kind of moving on a little bit, he is a slightly different person than the uh, old, what was it, Rigor Mortis. Um, but yeah, I love uh, that kind of opening segment, um, lots of uh, lots of time with uh, Nendo. Um, Kaido, I remember his name now, and uh, and Psyche last episode. Love that kind of trio, um, and hopefully we'll see a little bit more of that today as well. I can't remember what the preview had in store, but I remember it being pretty uh, pretty promising. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think of this episode down in the comment section. Leave a like on the video if you guys liked, and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date with these reactions. And let's get right into it, guys. I can't quite remember what the preview had in store. Again, it's been a little while since I watched last episode. But um, as I mentioned a couple episodes ago, actually, Psyche's dad is actually, again, growing on me quite a bit. I didn't really like him at the start of the series. But again, he's actually uh, come around quite a bit to me. I think maybe just a bad first impression, as uh, as many people would probably get from uh, from that man. This again, this song is so crazy, isn't it? It is like like three or four songs kind of stitched together. <laughs> the uh, again, the extended opening, um, the extended kind of actual release of the version is actually even crazier as well. So it's got even more kind of songs. I'm not sure how much long longer we got left this first season. I think there is quite a bit more material. Um, I, I think there's at least a second season, but I think there's a few specials as well. I haven't exactly looked too far into it, to be honest with you. But, um, yeah, I do think there's at least a second season, which is good news. Makes sense, makes sense. This is where Psyche's at. Or Cider Man. I love that kid, he's really cute, isn't he? They do very much look like family don't they <laughs> yeah that's all you need a bit of cake But did we not come here to learn how to cook? Not to buy cakes. <laughs> that is kids for you, isn't it? Although that might be a bit unrealistic, I don't, I don't feel like that plate would be absolutely clean. Oh, oh, Bassan, damn! Oh shit! Well, we need to get a look at this. Number two was creepy. I think it is quite creepy, to be honest, isn't it? Isn't she? From what we know, no one from the outside was here as creepy. I don't think. Yeah, ugly number one, of course. 
creep. Again, kind of makes sense because she is a creep. <laughs> Can we split the check? Wow, well, that's uh, yeah, okay. There's Auntie Orbasan, unsightly pig, is somehow number five and not all the way up here. Hmm, who are you again? Oh, damn. Yeah, yeah well, that one makes sense, doesn't it? Dare da deska. Tap water is okay, right? Oh, what was that one? What was that one? Oh, oh, I see. So when she goes to like a restaurant or something, and they say, "Is tap water okay for your drink or something?" Or when she goes around someone's house and says that someone says that, really? That's. I mean, we know how she's like, <laughs> but tap water is fine. Right? They're not putting anything in it. I hope. <laughs> uh, I drink quite a bit of tap water. There's no way I'm. Uh, I don't mind buying bottled water every now and then. Obviously, don't want to do it often. Obviously, I drink one. Usually, I keep a bottle for like a month or so. Then I buy a new one because I play football. Got to bring a water bottle. But um, and especially in some places like festivals and such, water price is ridiculous. That they just because they know uh, they can get away with it. They charge like five pound for a bottle of fucking water. What an absolute joke! Did I reset the timer? Sorry guys, I'm I'm gonna rewind again. Apologies. I feel like I probably did set the timer. <laughs> but my uh Yeah, I think I did, didn't I? I did. Sorry guys, just wanna make sure. Where were we at? Four minutes, one second. <clears throat> Honestly, that's pretty weird, isn't it? Again, that is that is creepy. Saying you're gonna flirt with him in ten years' time. I mean, I don't think he'll have any problem with that. But pretty fucked up. Pretty messed up. <laughs> oh, number 31 hey something about bread I saw there I'm not going to pause every time you get the picture well, yeah, everyone's appearing in this bloody show aren't they each girl I mean, they kind of do. Oh dear. That's just kids for you though, isn't it? Anything to do with like, their favourite TV show or anything they go crazy over. That's what it's like for me as well. I never saw a person as, as a character in one of our kind of shows, but again, I'd love like, little items like Power Ranger toys and Transformers. I love little uh, toys like that back in the day. It was rather flashy, isn't it?
they go like ten percent over or under. Okay, some leeway there. It would be very tough if it was exact, wouldn't it? And when he says value, does he mean does he actually mean kind of money value as well? I I always kind of took that as the value of like the the volume and the weight of the object. I guess it kind of works for both, maybe. It says when it comes to money, maybe it's value. When it comes to the item, it's the different value. Honestly, not a bad idea. Send your send your pants. Gonna trade our way up. <laughs> hey. Let's go. What a great manga. Got the main three on the uh, on the cover as well. <laughs> Pretty cheap, but worth more. Bit of beef, okay. Sure, this is like that fucking. TikTok, I, I have TikTok, but that kind of TikTok trend of people trading their way up of stuff, like Pokemon cards and stuff like that. Swap it with something slightly more valuable. Hey, let's go. What you got there? How fucking dare you? Fucking Mr. What? Damn, everyone really got fucked over here, but I guess I maybe half deserve it. Especially you. No, what, what, what horrible bastards those uh those attendant people were. Oh, I think Terahashi's going to win that, isn't she? What did they say? Terrible, terrible dresser. Something like that. Terribly dressed customer. These horrible bastards. That, okay, I thought it looked quite flashy and quite cool, to be honest. Quite like that. Nice different look. Ah... <laughs> uh. That's name. But what is this cat's name? Libyon sounds like a pretty good name for a cat. I think that's the name of the uh of the mech, wasn't it? What is the name of this cat? Amp. <laughs> oh dear <laughs> Your creepy fucking face made me go home I feel like we're going to have to rub rubbish through some poo at some point in this episode Oh, well, to be fair, maybe not. I thought maybe he might eat it and we wanted to rummage through some poo to, uh, to fix the robot. Uh, yeah, what was plan B? Ah, oh, really? You'd actually do this? 
<laughs> Tiny psyche. Yeah, really? This seems pretty disgusting. Yeah, that's probably the least bad of it, is the smell. <laughs> yeah. He reached, what's it called? That place called again? I forget. The place between death and life. No, you're not. Oh, what the fuck was that? Some kind of insect? Oh god. I mean, it should be easy to deal with, right? Oh crap. Honestly, that's a bit sad. Most of the fun of that stuff comes in actually making it yourself, doesn't it? Oh, nice. Saving his life actually came, came in handy. That's good to see. Getting along in the end. Saving each other's life. Something about that that bonds you. What, what is that place called? Oh, God. <laughs> what kind of bump was that? <laughs> I'm going to bump this kid. Yeah, slightly. You know what it sounds like the pot of a manga to someone, doesn't it? And of its own story. You're not going to do anything about that, Psyche? Yeah, it looks bad on the teachers, doesn't it? What is a she take? Shit take. <laughs> what is a what is a shit take? What the fuck is she take? Some kind of food. No, I just kind of thought he was lying about that, but I guess not. No, it looks like a proper prep school suit now, except for those eyes, of course. Bold. <laughs> now he really looks like a delinquent. What the fuck is a punch perm as well? Abizo. This guy looks more like an Asbo. Look, like that's like some kind of rapper or something. Abizo.
Damn. Holy shit. Now, if this don't change him, nothing will. Jesus. Oh, let's go. Just a pair of glasses. <laughs> but that's enough to say, say that whole story. Oh, dear. Oh, I was wrong. Of course, it, to be fair, it's always going to be Nendo, actually, wasn't it? He's won every kind of physical thing so far, hasn't he? I thought Terahashi might win it just for the power of her, the power of her persuasion. The Grand Chocolate Parfait. <laughs> Man, I really love these voice actors. No, you're about to be excellent at this, aren't you? Even if she's not. And she is. It's like a proper idol, bloody hell. Because <laughs> I'm a perfect, beautiful girl. Pretty cool song, actually, as well. Pretty fucking good. Those lyrics are terrible, but pretty good. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely Kaido's type of songs here. Nice bloody. Oh, well, that makes sense. Oh no, it was ours. <laughs> Enjoy your awkward atmosphere. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, another cool song there for Kaido. Again, shame we didn't get to hear it that well. But again, definitely, uh, definitely quite the thing song. Nendo happened. Well, at least you get to eat the parfait in peace. <laughs> My gentle song. There it is. <laughs> with the nails Ugh. really we're just bad to eat it oh crap we fucked ourselves oh crap Good idea. <laughs> Good idea. But also bad because Nendo's going to be singing again. That was a nice way to end off. Really good episode in general, wasn't it?
That's a bit of everything in today's episode, wasn't there? Quite a few characters involved. Again, there's a lot less of the uh, the blonde head girl than what I'd like to be honest with you. I actually quite like her as a character. I mean, to be fair, I say that she probably is one of the least interesting in terms of what we've already explored about her. But again, that just leaves room for more, doesn't it? And uh, Mera as well, of course. She's uh, she's had a little bit of focus on her, but I did think both of those girls would be quite a bit more prominent. But Teru Hashi really is the uh, the most prominent, isn't she? Quite a long way. I think all the guys are quite evenly uh, kind of covered again, except for maybe Nendo, Kaido, and um, Psyche. Of course, they are. The kind of main ones. I would have liked to hear that full version of Kaido's song as well, to be fair. It sounded really cool, actually. Almost like a, an Attack on Titan opening. Sounded like a little bit. Quite the, uh, quite the, well, I say heartwarming, quite the unfortunate story as well, the one just before this. We'll get into it in a second, but... So we've gone small again. Oh, it's the old guy that we see in the opening. These are the grandparents. Okay. okay, that should be a fun episode. I remember saying a while ago I was looking forward to meeting these uh these uh these grandparents. But um yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um again, really good episode today. So I think I especially enjoyed that second last one there about the uh, the high school bully. To be honest with you, uh, again that was actually quite um, heartwarming and quite touching at the end of that, wasn't it? Of course, it didn't end off too nicely, but um, everything before that again was actually really, really quite wholesome and cool, wasn't it? Um, but yeah, but lots of uh, lots of funny moments there again. A um, lot of Terahashi, a um, lot of Terahashi in general lately, isn't there? Like I said, she just kind of uh, taken up quite a lot of the screen time from the other girls. Uh, I would like to see maybe some of the other girls in more episodes and um, having a, a bigger part. But like I did say, they're probably two of the least interesting characters. Cause their characteristics are very kind of not very deep if you know what i'm saying hers are hers are terahashi's i'm not really sure how to explain it but they're, they're quite um quite a big problem <laughs> if you know what i'm saying the other two again they've, they've actually been not explored too much and they've uh they've had a quite uh, they've had a reasonable amount of screen time but i um, would like to see a little bit more about their characters perhaps um maybe that might be a, something we cover in season two again i'm not sure how long we got left we got five or six episodes left so we've got a little bit of time left this season and again we've got a whole second season so um again looking forward to that at some point eventually but um again really nice episode today again lots of wholesome moments but um again another hilarious one uh do let me know what you guys think of this episode though down in the comment section leave a like on the video if you guys do like and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date with these reactions i'll be back next time with uh the much anticipated grandparents episode so looking forward to that and enjoy the rest of your day guys